Afternoon, everybody. Uh, with the market report from today, we had uh, 730 cattle here today at Mount Cumbus. In a job that was generally firm to marginally dear across the, across most categories. Uh, out of the 700 odd cattle, with about 110 cows, uh, they sold fully firm to probably 10 better in places, uh, especially the secondary type cow. The very best of the cows topped out at 255, with the majority of them making anywhere from 240 to 250. Uh, and then the really exceptional pens of cows are up to 255. The second run of cows were probably the cows that improved the most today. Uh, coming off of last week when they slipped back, they were making 210 or 20 last week. Today we had a lot more cows in the anywhere from sort of 35 to 45, just just uh, just underneath the good cows. Uh, once we got back into the light cows, we didn't have a. It was a bit of a fair drop off today. There was the cows were either good or they were very light. The very light cows. Uh, battled at times if they were sound and could travel and had a little bit of weight cows made anywhere from a dollar seventy through to through to a couple of bucks uh, but then we sold some cows less than a dollar and those cows were were very plain uh, very plain and very light uh, the bull job fully firm nowhere near as many bulls today only about 10 or 15 and uh, but fully firm with most of the bulls if they were good with a bit of yield about them 240 into your secondary types making 225 to 230 and then uh, got onto some dairy types still making 210 to 215 which uh, was a pretty reasonable sale heavy steers fully firm add a couple of nice runs of grain fed sort of yearling type heavy steers anywhere from 480 through to sort of 550 kilos uh, pens of them were making anywhere from 275 through to about 290 depending on breed um, Grass steers, we had a few heavier fellas up around the six to 700 kilos. Again, they were, they were sort of anywhere from 270 to 290 again, depending on breed and finish again. Uh, not a lot of heifers to quote today. We didn't have anywhere near the number of, of grown heifers as what we did last week. The few that we did have, 250 to 270. I think there was the odd sale out to 280 if they were uh, if they were absolutely Mickey Mouse. Uh, the Vila jobs definitely kicked on. The butchers are struggling to find the, cattle, the light cattle with a bit of condition. Um, fully firm on last week, maybe a few more of them, a few more supplementary calves around the 400 kilos, but $3 to $3.30 uh, consistently if they're good. If you slip into your secondary tops, lack a little bit of yield, but still handy enough, $2.70 to $3. Bucks. Uh, we got steers returning the feedlot, $2.80 to $3. Uh, I think topped out at $3.12 for a good pen of Angus steers. Uh, same heifers were anywhere from 250 to 270. Your little cattle returning to the paddock. Uh, good pens of little cattle getting rewarded if you got good, well-bred calves there. Anywhere from sort of that three bucks to 330 as well. If you slip into the bits and pieces or a little bit off types, you're anywhere from sort of 250 to three dollars for a steer, and and heifers down 220 to to 250. Uh, your little light little mickeys today. We didn't have a heap of them, but. Returning into the feedlot if they were 400 plus kilos, they'd make two bucks to 220 and, and topped out at 280 for some little 220 kilo cubs going back into the paddock. Generally today, I'd say the job was firm on last week. Numbers seem to be uh, just stabilised somewhere around that 700 to 750 seems to be what we'll have for the next few weeks. Yeah, so all things are looking fairly stable at the moment. Anyone that's interested, we've got a uh, bull open day over at Ashley Park, over at my ponga there tomorrow from uh, 10 to 12. Got about um, 40 to 50 Angus bulls on display there if anyone wants to call in and have a look. Apart from that, we'll uh, see you all next week. Thank you.